I was just gonna say, we're starting to feel a little less dead. No, I'm not. Allie, okay, see, the, the, yesterday what I did was I sat outside with Zoe. She was out in the, the grass. I just sat on the concrete, just throwing sticks at her, and I feel like I sweated it completely out. Allie, on the other hand, did not, so she's still feeling kind of crappy. However, we cannot let this get to us because the RV trip is coming and we have to go get a bunch of hiking stuff in order to make sure we actually get to do more this time. Just, just like boots. To, we don't have to get a bunch of stuff. Like we just need to get a few things like that for where we're hiking, I think is going to be necessary. Right. Um, I don't know if you can hear myself and why I'm walking in the freaking dirt is because I have brand new chucks and I have to get them dirty because you can't, brand new chucks are just not cool. So you just gotta, you gotta get dirty. I just realized I should have grabbed my chair from the uh, the trailer on tour. I had a nice chair that I bought. It was cheap, but it was nice. Come on. <laughs> Allie's dying. I think we should get this. We should bring this with us. No. This will fit in the RV, I think. We can get a little smoker for all the veggies we, we cook. <laughs> we have you got a vampire sneeze, babe. Vampire sneeze. What are they for? <laughs> Come on. Really? Oh, are they just hiking poles? Here, pull the end. <laughs> Bless you, babe. So what does it do? Just, you see where the water is? Oh, so the walking pole. Yeah. Walking sticks are in the, it's called the woods. Yeah. They're popular. And they're called free. They're yeah. sticks. If anything, we can have Zoe start looking for them for us. <laughs> felt terrible. Now, this is how the plague started. Patient zero over here. She has hand sanitizer and she's vampire sneeze. <laughs> see the vampire sneeze? This could be fun. I also. You might be allergic to the store. Oh my yeah, God. I know exactly. Oh my God. Terrible. <laughs> That's right. We're we're not telling you guys yet. Technically, we're not supposed to tell you, <laughs> but we'll tell you soon. This is more for us to get ready. Oh, look at this mosquito netting. This is what you need, babe. This would be fun, yeah. This would be fun, though. Be By the way, idea. huh? Dry bags. Yeah, we need a dry bag. That's smart. It well, looks like we're buying that one. I just, oh, I can sneeze on my hands. You guys want to know a little thing about me? I don't know how to fold clothes. I just can't do it. Where if I can through water, we're gonna need this. But what's the point of this? Then a snake could just bite you right in the foot. You really don't have to worry about that. I'm, I mean, I don't think that's the first thing on my mind. Is like, hey, is this snake gonna bite my foot? What was but the movie? I want water. Please. We just watched a movie where the girl went high. Oh. Uh, something about Beth, life after Beth. Life after Beth. She went hiking, she got bitten by a snake, and she died. These are water. So immediately, I think snakes. And if that's the case, babe, I think we need to do these. I got jorts now. Yeah, okay. This is good for the water. You're, you're ridiculous, you know that, right? Okay, don't knock them till you try them. How about these? I told all you guys about how that wave in New York, New York, it was not New York City, in Jones Beach completely knocked me over and the ocean essentially stole my uh, GoPro. Last time we did this road trip, I was able to get a lot of cool like B-roll, like travel stuff from the RV. So I unfortunately had to get another one because I have all these gimbals now. So I'm actually going to be able to get a lot better footage. Plus I have that drone, which are my favorite shots where we were driving and the RV was below. So I need to unfortunately get another GoPro because I was gonna be like, oh, you know, I have a warranty. Excuse me, sir, where's the camera? Well, the ocean ate it. I got a toy. Actually, I should say a tool. I got a tool. Now I can shoot all the slow motion stuff at 240 frames per second. So it's gonna look good, guys. You gotta make it look good for you. The radtacular. That's that's a word apparently. Here, I'll get you in this, and then you don't have to you don't have to walk. I look at this like uh, I'm helping right now. It literally just died as I went through the uh, the, <laughs> the bus. 
I literally just died the second I got through the door. So it's like literally stuck right in the middle of the door. <laughs> the guy was like, oh, did it die on you? I'm like, I'm sorry, man. It's, I tried. So he did appreciate it. So that's, that's... oh, poor girl. <laughs> We should take you home, and I can take all this stuff. So bad, everything hurts. We gotta get you that. <laughs> Naturally, Allie wants the cactus one. It's a kid's one. But your butt won't fit in that. Well, I can get this pink one if you want, because it's five ninety-seven, and then you could get that one. So red and pink. Well, it's just because they don't have they don't have the ones that don't have the mesh back. So I guess I lied. I guess I had the cheap one. Oh, they have a green one. They don't have it? They don't have any of them. They're all, this is all the mesh ones. Okay. Do they have dog backpacks? Don't take life sitting down. Allows women to, the convenience of standing to urinate. It's clean, portable, discreet, and reusable. <laughs> Essentially, it just gives women a penis. <laughs> <laughs> That's clever. Oh, the life straws? Yeah, I don't foresee us. It's just really interesting. So think about it. I want you to get the go girl thing and try it and see what works. We'll tell it. Oh, what about that? We might need that for all the snakes. Should I get like a BB gun or a pellet gun? No. I don't like real guns, so maybe a pellet gun will be fine. Shoot a bear right in the butt. It'll go away. We don't hurt it. There we go. Well, guys, I tried to be my cold, but I there can't. we go. I can't do it. You hey, buddy. You hungry? Oh, now you like me. You're always very difficult with me. We got the good stuff. Look. Come on. <laughs> oh, Kitty is so happy. I know, you're so happy. All you wanted was your wet food and to see your aunt. Yeah, I know. We just came to hang out with Kat for a little bit. I'm actually gonna probably take advantage of this couch and um, how amazingly comfortable it looks right now because I feel so terrible. I don't want to keep complaining, but I think it's better that I have this cold now rather than later because I know that if I was on the RV trip, because remember that time on the RV trip last year with Charles when he got sick towards the end and I had to get all those things to make him feel better? You need a nice little kiss, you just let me know. You kiss me out. <laughs> One, two, three. <laughs> Don't you feel so much better? <laughs> yes. Yeah, that clip right there. I don't want to have to have him take care of me. I want us to be healthy and well. We're going to definitely announce in the next couple of days where we're going, what we're doing. Um, the whole shebang. I know we've been talking about it a lot, but we're so excited and I can't believe that it's actually right around the corner. So exciting, honestly. It's just gonna be so exciting. I feel like I should just do one of those chalkboard chalk outlines and just, this is where she died. No, don't say that. I'm what? just, it's weird my body's like on fire. It's like I'm cold, but then I'm like really hot too. So we just found out if you put the your hand on the back of somebody, like right here, that you can, that's an easy way to tell if you have a um, a fever, and I think you do. Nah. Yeah, she does. Oh, baby, come what do you want to do? You know what? I was, who was I talking to? Um, where I was Demos. I was talking to Demos, and he's like, "It's kind of funny." No one's like, "Oh, my cat acts like a dog," and he's like, "Well, maybe you're not a cat person. Maybe you should just get <laughs> maybe you should just get a dog." And I was like, <laughs> "That makes a lot of sense." He's like, "Oh, because I said like, you know, I love Rita because she acts like a dog." And he's like, you know, I hear that a lot about people with cats. What and he's doing? like, why, why don't you just get a dog? He sees the lizard. That, that lizard's looking at him like, what? That lizard's is ballsy. Make him go. Go, make him. Nah. Game over. I uh, updated my phone. Yeah. <laughs> I just don't feel good. I know. I'm vlogging over here, babe. Um, I'm, I got the iOS 12 beta. My friend who works yeah. there, guys again. Um, he works for Apple, that's the reason why I went to the Apple thing during Warp Tour. He told me to update to the public beta of iOS 12, and I was just messing with it. I was talking to my friend Ricky, there it is again. And uh, apparently you can do like, you know, think about like, you know, on Snapchat with the face filters. You can do that with the emojis, and the best thing is that you can make your own. So I thought it'd be kind of funny to call my sister and my dad and just various people with like the monkey and stuff like that and just goof around with it. So we're gonna try that. Hey, I'm Melissa Sriffy. I'm all about having a goatee. Five o'clock shadow on my... No, this is a goatee. No, what do they call this one? 
I'll leave that to your imagination. Uh, right, Allie just finished it up. Uh, 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 so dumb. Does that look like her? Yep, perfect. Hi, I'm Melissa Trippy. Let's call her. I, hang on, I gotta look at her brows now. These are my lips and my nose. <laughs> There's my ears. She's got, how they can't even see the ears. What does it matter? Because well, her hair's long. Oh, she needs some earrings up in here. <laughs> All right, let's call her. I like chocolate. I like chocolate. Oh my god, that's so funny. <laughs> this is what my nose looks like right now. <laughs> no. <Nah. laughs> this is the greatest one. Vinny, look. I love it. Cook a dead dude. Me with these features now. <laughs> I don't know, Melissa. I feel like death. Oh, hey girl, what you doing over there? Oh, you know me. I'm just using my little dinosaur legs. You know, doing dinosaur push-ups. <laughs> huh? You gotta laugh. What time should I be there tomorrow? <laughs> <laughs> what? Like, answer me! <laughs> Where'd you get that? Hey, Dad. Oh, oh no, look what? at this. <laughs> Wait, I had to do it like this. Oh my god, it looked just like your dad! <laughs> <laughs> Wait, Dad, look at it like this. Do it like the same way. Like I normally do? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, do it. I'm going to send that to Melissa. Apparently, Allie right now is at 100 degree uh, fever, so I'm keeping an eye on it. Uh, I think, I'm was sorry, it one of the three? I hate, like, showing this side because I feel like... What's life? Well, I know, but I just... I don't want us to, like, come off as complainers. We're so not I think com about that a lot. I mean, you got 100 degree fever. I don't think anyone thinks you're complaining. You already have a deal. If it gets close to 103, time for the doctors. So we have a deal. I really don't want it to go that high. No, I don't want it to either. But we have, because typically when people are sick, they always fight. They're like, oh, I don't need to go to the doctor. I do it all the time. I'm not fighting you. No, I know. We have an agreement. I'm 103, not close. You just remember the last time I had like a really, really high fever. You had dengue? Yeah, which I don't have. No, you don't have dengue again. But it's true, like your fever was like 105 then. It was like. I was, it was really, it was. It was really it was bad. So high that we went to where Melissa works and they, they called over to the ER and had me sent there right away. This is a cooler thermometer. You want me to do it? You sure? Wanna go back to the back seat again? As you saw yesterday's video, Allie had 101 temperature. She has 102 now. So Melissa came by and we're gonna take her to the, I wanted to say vet. <laughs> I'm so used to saying going to the vet. And we're taking her to go to the doctor. And uh, she's completely done for right now. You okay? Any thumbs up yet? No. Yeah, that was actually a really scary time. But uh, she's out. She made it. She's totally. I mean, we. I just have the warped tour kind of like sickness because, like, I know that a lot of people. Frankie had it. Like, Colin Frankie, had it. Uh, Ryan Sophie said he has it. Jake got it. Um, you know what's funny is all the people that don't really drink alcohol got it. Do you got it? I know, and I don't drink alcohol. Trust me, the warped tour bug is just as bad as the VidCon flu. Don't you do it. Don't. All right, now I gotta play with this guy. The thing I'm really, really stoked about is that I can do 1080p at 240 frames per second. So that means really awesome videos, really awesome slow motion stuff for you guys. And 4K at 60 frames per second. 
that mm -hmm. sounds awesome, but probably no one watches YouTube videos at 4K, so 1080p at 240 is probably what we're looking at. All right, so I just made Allie go to bed. She's feeling, I think the temperature is still about the same, but if she lays down, take a shower, or take a bath or something like that, I think it'll, I can hear her from here. Um, so please don't forget to subscribe, guys, and we will see you tomorrow as always. <laughs> you can still hear. All right, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Good night.